everyone, and welcome to part 23 of Spyro Year of the Dragon. So, let's go to Dino Mines today. This is probably going to be the last video I record today. This is the fourth video that I am currently recording. I was only going to do, um, three, but, uh, it turned out to be less time than I thought. Uh, let's beat some of the levels, so it gave me a little bit of extra recording time. Yeah, see, these dinosaurs got guns, and they aren't very nice. I do believe the cactus in this actually dropped gems, so yeah. There actually is a purpose for destroying them. Now, this level... Uh, this level's not gonna be too easy. Like, see, there's stuff hidden around corners and such. We have Dan. I thought we already got a Dan, but apparently not. And I do not believe Moneybags is actually here or in the next level, so I'm pretty sure, you know, we're good. You know, I don't like how this level, though, has the Molten Crater music. It's kind of lame, though, how it chose that music again. It doesn't really fit this level. And I don't know why rabbits are sheriffs of a world filled with dinosaurs. No, no, no. It's like almost impossible to avoid being hit by that guy. These guys not so much, but the ones that shoot you with their dual wielding revolvers, yeah. Not very easy to avoid. And it's weird because the fodder here are crabs. Oh, this last world seems to be very, very weird when put together. Thank you. And it even sounds like the slugs and everything, and the pigs and stuff. Doo doo. Doo doo. Wait, what? Oh, in the building, okay. Oh, that was uncalled for there, dinosaur. Yeah, dinosaurs that have turrets. Because that is normal. Oh, we actually took them down before getting shot. And yes, Agent 9 is mandatory to beat this. And yes, you can kind of figure where this is going. It's not going to be very easy, guys. This vid this level will definitely will probably be the only other the only level in this video. Because I highly doubt we're going to have time to do another level with what's going on. I don't know what kind of dinosaurs these are supposed to be, though. They're like seahorse mummy dinosaurs. Can you stop? Man. The, this, the music with this, like, water, though, just doesn't sound right. It doesn't sound like you'd have this type of level with this music. I think they got lazy and just like, uh, we don't actually want to make a song for this world, so, you know, yeah. Ow, no fair! Uh, uh. Now, oh, there's another one, and there was a crack in the wall. And our second egg, Romy! Hey, you had a soother. Or a binky, or whatever, depending on what your family calls it. Okay, yeah, looks like the gems are now outside of the water area. Which would be up here. No, you get off the cliff. I really don't want to deal with you. Oh, great, now I have no health. Good news is, though, the spawn point was right there, so... No! Yeah, go figure, he was gonna get me. Darn it, so enemies do respawn in this game. Okay, like, you seriously gotta rush these guys. I don't believe there is an easier way to kill them. 
gosh darn it. And gosh darn it kind of fits, because it's like a western level filled with dinosaurs. Does it really feel like dino mines, though? Like, I guess maybe there's like that watery mine, but... It really doesn't feel like a mine level, not like banjo Tooie. Like the Glimmer Gulch mine? Now that is a freaking mine level. Yay, look! We broke into the end of the level! Well, I'll be! So that's how my prisoners were escaping. Kiki, egg three. Jumping. And I do believe, though, that one of the other eggs is one of those, um, like, things where you have to go down the tunnel with the enemies and such. And I do believe that's in here. Actually, five minutes in, we're not doing too bad. One of them I believe this one, though, is just obstacle avoiding. Yeah, this one is just obstacle avoiding, so this is a little different. Like, yeah, there's more obstacles, but... Sometimes I find it easier just because you don't actually have to kill the enemy, and apparently my analog stick didn't want to move. And good thing is, too, if you fail these ones, you don't actually lose lives. Like, I could kind of see them doing that just to piss people off, but in reality, they don't. Like, Insomniac is actually a really good company. Well, they make some of my favorite games, being Spyro and Ratchet. Say Ratchet and Clank, but it's not always Ratchet and Clank. Frig, no! We did so well, and then I messed up. Bummer butts. And now I'm just failing terribly because, uh, you know. You know, I guess I could edit some of my videos so they're not, like, super long and, you know, like, edit out all the fails or, like, the searching of gems and stuff until I get to the point. But, I don't know. Like, my videos are never over 25 minutes for the Spyro series. Except I, I believe there might have been one 28-minute one. I'm not actually 100% sure, but... This one is better if you stay up. Why do you always hit that one, Sparrow? It's like he gets sucked down into like a little vortex or something. There's 149 eggs and we have 137. I believe there is... Yeah, the three eggs left here. Which will bring us to 140. And then... The six in the next level. Okay, yeah, I know where all the eggs are in this game then. Most of them we can't, or a few of them we can't get until we actually beat the game. Thank you, you actually made it through. Thank you, Holiday. Thank you for Elliot. Elliot Moose is on the loose. And goodbye. And let's go up here and go to the... Yeah, there's no gems in this area, so that just leaves Agent Nine's area. The sheriff, prom well, the sheriff promised me a million doll hairs if I did this. Yeah, and I believe this is first person mode again. Oh, yeah, no, this is auto first person mode. And apparently he's not dying. Like, what the heck? I lost most of my health because a stupid dinosaur wouldn't die. And am I dead? No, I guess I live with one health. Why do I hear some weird sound effect in the back? Terrifying. Terrifyingly delicious. The TNT ones are going to be the worst in this, not the other dinosaurs, because they got to draw their guns. And I do believe you have to talk to them every time. Yeah. There, you guys didn't take forever to die that time. I don't know what took them so long last time. And to collect the gems, you actually gotta beat this.
Sometimes just knowing um, where the enemies are though really helps you. I don't know if you can collect gems in this mode. Woo, close one. While the TNT ones are easier as Spyro, they're more difficult as Agent 9. Oh, that was it, okay. How are there so many dinosaurs in there? They're so freaking huge. What did I take damage from? Why am I only at 75? I can see you jumping down from the roof. I said to fix my glasses there for a second. And yes, everyone that hasn't seen my face, I do wear glasses. Ah, skill point! We killed some weird dinosaur. Dude, no, don't, don't you dare live. There we go, we did it. I don't know why, but here's Sharon the Egg. Wait, what's the other egg here then? Take it to the bank. Oh, I believe there's one that we can actually get as Agent 9 just walking around. That might be where the other egg is. And man, he has over a hundred gems in this world, or in this part of the level. I think this level is meant more for Agent 9 than anything. I don't like that how he goes into first person mode though. Oh man, my neck and back and ribs are so sore from having the flu. It's crazy. Yes, as you guys do know, the last few episodes before, I think the last three I've recorded, I had the flu. Which took a lot out of me, so I'm sorry I didn't get them uploaded the day that I recorded them, but I was just too sick. Anyways, let's hop in here. There's the egg! Woohoo, this is a bank. This is a very bad bank. But we got Sergio. Yeah, it's, okay, so it'll be six from the next uh, level, and then one for beating the final boss, and then one for beating um, uh, Sparks level, and then there is a secret egg. That is technically the last egg, and I do love getting it. Boom, shaka, laka, 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 boom, 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 boom. Huh. You wouldn't say that there's gems in here, eh, deputy? Oh, wait, what? More behind here? Sparks, you are very bad at telling me where all these gems are. You know that, right, sir? I hate though that he can't... Okay, it's apparently in here. In here somewhere? Yeah, it's in here. Oh wait, no, 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 it's over here actually. Okay, I'm gonna have to go around. <laughs> So still this way. Oh, probably in there, right? Okay, these ones you don't actually have to break open. And there we go! 
Dino Lions is now 100% complete. Which means we can now leave. So another 700 gems. Bring us to 6,100. Yeah, and we definitely don't have time to do the next level in this video because the next level is actually very, very long. I wouldn't say very, very long, but there is a challenge that does take a little bit of patience. So anyways, in the next episode, we will be going to the Haunted Tomb, I believe is what it is called. Uh, and uh, yeah, then maybe we can take on the final boss in that episode. So anyways, next episode, Haunted Tomb.